Hey guys, I uh, just want to give you a quick look at the uh, sheets we finished up yesterday. Uh, we got all four of them done. Uh, here's the one for the dagger, throwing knife. It's going to be a neck knife. Look over there, obviously. But yeah, sticks in there. It's not going to fall out when you're walking around. And then if you want. Pull it right out, ready to go. So yeah, there's that one there. And uh, this one can go in both ways. Because it's dagger, obviously. <clears throat> we have this one here. I don't think I uh, showed you this one yesterday. This one's getting made up for a knife gang sent out to... Uh, our friend Dan Gark at DSD Fourth Right Outdoors. Black walnut scales on there. It's the DM50. Stone wash finish. And uh, yeah, we just finished up the sheath there. We just started putting these uh, belt loops on. Uh, the smaller knives don't really need them, but the bigger ones are kind of nice so that it's not digging in your hip. But yeah, it sticks in there. Looks really good with the leather, everything kind of matches. <clears throat> Haven't named this one yet, it's going to be going up for sale later today. But uh, we got the sheath finished for it also. Leather, we got a uh, grey band on this one. And these are all handmade, everything's handcrafted. And sticks in there. Last one here for the little paracord knife. We're gonna put a uh, belt loop on this one, but I think it's uh, it's really light and uh, it's kind of nice just like this. Your belt hooks through there and just stays really nice to uh, nice and tight to your hip. But yeah, the black walnut bead really nice and matches uh, sorry matches the uh, leather uh, band on there. This one's a super light one. Be nice to throw in your backpack or whatever, go hunting, go hiking. And uh, just a couple blades we're working on here. This is gonna be a, a set of the same style pins. These extra holes are just to take out weight. And then uh, we have this chef's knife. Just finished heat treating this, need to clean it up. Got a full flat grind on there. And uh, we're working on this big chef's knife too. Trying to work on a uh, hidden plunge line. I don't know if you can see, but it was like this on the uh, the other side too. And then uh, kind of blended in so you can't see it at all. So you won't see any plunge line there and then just a little bevel along the bottom. So yeah, that's what we're working on right now. Thanks guys, have a good day.